What's up guys, in this video we'll quickly go over some of Rosalina's best combos for racking up damage, and then we'll cover some of her best kill confirms. To start off, aggressively using Daknair is one of Rosa's safest combo starters. If you fast fall early enough, Luma's dash attack can true combo into the late hit of Rosa's Nair, which can also guarantee you an up smash at lower percents. To quickly recap how to do this, start by using dash attack, then within 2 frames jump and release the control stick, then simply drift forward. Around mid percent, you can substitute the up smash follow up for a neutral air, which can lead to more follow ups. And at high percent, the sequence can act as a kill confirm, which we'll cover in the next section of this video. Just keep in mind that the Nair follow up will not connect against all characters at 0%. Here's a list of the minimum damage needed for Luma's dash attack to combo into Rose's Nair against each character. Aggressively using Daknair is also strong against shields, as you can up tilt with Luma before most characters have the chance to act out of shield. When using this tech, take note of your spacing and opponent's damage, as hitting your opponent near its max range or when they have too much damage will often put them too far away to be hit by Rosa's follow-up Nair. If this happens, note that you still have a frame advantage and can grab your opponent before they can grab you. This brings us to a huge part of Rosa's combo game, throws. Rosa can get a ton of mileage off grabs at low percent, and one of Rosa's best low percent throw combos is to forward throw, then dash in with a well-spaced Nair. If done correctly, you should be able to combo Luma's Nair into a late Rosa Nair, which can guarantee you an up air. If you factor in the extra damage from either a lunar landed back air or a Luma dash attack, plus 2 pummels, this combo can deal over 45%, which is huge considering it's a true combo. Just note that it won't work against these characters due to their height, weight, and other attributes. You need to be very precise to utilize each hit of Nair separately, so you may hit the opponent with both Nairs. If this happens, fast falling can still put you in a position to frequently catch them with an up tilt. If you grab your opponent with your back facing the ledge, you could pressure them by using a back throw and comboing into a short hop fair. From here, most players will jump, which you can cover by drifting back and timing an up air. If you ever notice that your opponent doesn't jump in this position, you can sometimes get a quick kill by double jumping and using forward air again, then finish them off with a luma shot. One advantage to back throw is that its follow up fair is guaranteed against every character at 0%, however you need to dash a bit extra to reach the fast fallers like Fox. If you ever grab your opponent and they're at too high of a percent to perform a forward or back throw combo, remember you can still guarantee an up throw into up air for a quick burst of damage. This is Rosa's most common throw combo for racking up damage, as it's true even up to 71% on lightweights like Pichu, 94% on normal weights like Robin, and 129% on heavyweights like Bowser. Just note that at certain percentages, they'll only be hit by the Luma up air if they DI away in time, so it can sometimes be a good idea to skip out on pummeling. Like most characters, Rosalina most frequently gets kills with well-timed smash attacks, or aerials other than her Nair. However, she has quite a few methods for confirming kills off more convenient attacks. One fairly reliable method is to hit your opponent with the late hit of Rosa's Nair, as it can guarantee you an up air which can often kill when over 100%. This also works when aggressively using Daknair, however you'll need to use this closer to your opponent as their damage gets higher. If your opponent is near the ledge before attempting this, it may be even better to cancel your Nair into a wave dash forward, which can hit confirm into a Rosalina forward smash. To do this, input a dash attack, then immediately input a jump. Lastly, input a wave dash diagonally forward with the grab button within 3 frames. Another way to confirm a kill off Luma is by Lunar Landing with Neutral Air. If you hit your opponent with a Lunar Landed Nair while they're at high percent, you can combo into an up air for a kill. And remember that Nair or up air can be used for this confirm even while Luma is recalling or returning after a Dak Nair. In these recall scenarios, you can also Lunar Land with Back Air, and if spaced correctly, you can combo them into a Rosa Forward Smash. You can learn more about this tech in my Luma Control Guide by clicking here. Also, be sure to leave any questions down below in the comment section, and hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss out on more content like this. Thanks for watching, and as always, I'll see you next time.